Hey, Apollo Baptist Church, this is Pastor Gary and Kareem and Naeem. Um, they're here with me at the office today um, working on stuff, and we just wanted to tell you how excited we were about Kids Camp. That's right. Um, Kids Camp is coming up on this Sunday. That's right, on Sunday. Um, Two days from now. And when we go, um, we're going to be gone. A week. Well, pretty much a week. Sunday yeah, through days. Friday. So it's like six days. So pretty much. Six days. Um, yeah. Uh, are you, so what do you guys, what, you guys have never been to kids camp before. So how and, and do you feel? I've been to Christopher Creek before. You have been to Christopher Creek before. That's true. So, I mean, how do you guys feel about it? I feel like, I mean, you guys are going to go really there again. I'm excited. I'm like really excited. Wait. And they have these very cool cabins. I wish. They do have. They I wish. Could, I well, we're not going to Christopher Creek Lodge. That's on the same creek, but it's a, we're going to Mountain a Meadows part Ranch. Of the creek? Oh. It's a it's a different spot. Oh. So. So um, the same creek, but a different spot in the creek. Yeah, a different spot in the creek. It's yeah. cool. If there's like two creeks. So we've been there, but yeah. we haven't been in, in the same so spot. So what are some things that you're hoping that God will do? at camp this protect year. Protect us and not help us fall in the river. Okay, protect us, help us not fall in the river. Oh, well, actually, I would like to fall in the river if I'm going to swim in it, but um, <laughs> yeah. yeah, let's not get hurt, okay? Yeah. Um, I would like to thank God for having, um, for making up fun, like like, that would, like we get to spend time with our family. Mm -hmm. Cause because I'm going. Yeah, because spend, spending time with family is a, is a really good um, a very good way to celebrate family. And I hope that people will want to um, send letters to to their parents that don't get to come, um, they and they don't get embarrassed to do it. Mm. Yeah, that's true. Kids camp it is like a big deal right now because we're, Cause like, we're all done packing you, right now. Maybe uh, I'm 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 hoping that you know God will God will speak to you. Um, that you will learn to hear God speak in your own heart, uh, even without even without any help at all, um, the is what I'm hoping. Is just God. Right, um, that's what I'm hoping. Um, mm -hmm. You know, we've been reading as a church uh, in Galatians, Galatians. Um, which is all about teaching people how to yeah hear from God and how to not hear from false gospels. Um, Kareem, you know a little bit about Galatians because we were reading it a little bit. What do you remember about it? Um, like it has stuff to do with um, the gospel. So like, um, if if people tell you a, a different gospel, then don't believe it. It has to be the same one uh, you you've heard um, in the Bible. Because like even if an angel comes there here and says and that, and that says, the real gospel is um, not true, then you just then don't believe it. Because an, angel an angel's still not God. An angel is still not God. If That's very true. We've got if, like, an angel. angels are like, they're not people that can fly like in movies. <laughs> they're... Maybe they can. Um, I don't know, but I don't know. yeah, uh, you're, but that's a great summary, Kareem, about it, Galatians, um, right? It's an excellent summary. Um, you know, Naima, uh, uh, you've probably never heard a false gospel before. You've only heard a, a good one and a right one, yeah, and I hope you never have to fe hear a false gospel. I've never heard a false gospel before. Like, that you shouldn't to listen to God because He like is not fair. Mm -hmm. yeah, even if an angel says that, you know mm, that's not true. But God has been teaching His angels to do the right thing, right? That's true, but almost no angels do that. Right, they but still do bad things. He has well, and I mean, and, and an angel wouldn't normally do that, right? They wouldn't. Like, um, like, like they wouldn't just come down from from heaven and say, right. Hey, the point isn't the me. point by of saying that isn't that angels are are evil. The point is that nothing is more important than Thank God's God. word. Right, very good. Nothing's more important uh, than God. So, well, that's what we want to talk to you about today, guys. Uh, church family, we, um, we're we excited uh, to go. We'll be in the service uh, on Sunday, obviously, but we won't, we won't be leaving from the church property until 2. But thank you for giving towards Kids Camp. It's a huge blessing to so many kids this year that couldn't afford it. We're taking a full load of people. We're taking twenty people. Thank you for um, all the grown-ups who um, who who made up the, this kids camp because because uh, we're gonna have a lot of fun. So That's right. people who are not pe uh, kids under three uh, un under three get ready for kids camp. <laughs> That's right. All right. Yeah. See you guys on Sunday.
Peace. Bye.